Hi guys and welcome back to Switch Up. Today we have a really nice sales video for you. There's a good sale on the US and the UK eShops and it's quite a limited one. Many of these finish on the 9th, few of them go on a little longer and we're trying to cover every genre. Yeah, as well as covering a mixture of genres, we've tried to be fair and take some of the games from the US store and some from the EU store. And I think we've got about a 50-50 split. first game is Dead Cells which also includes the Rise of the Giant DLC which added a few new boss fights and some new areas. What I liked most about this Roguevania as it calls itself is the weapon system which is split into three categories. These are colour coordinated and mean that you can deck out your builds for each run based around these. There's an excellent non-linear progression system so you can take different routes each time to keep it fresh. An excellent game and definitely worth picking up. Next up then we have The Binding of Isaac which is currently on the US store at 50% off. Now this is another roguelite dungeon crawler which sees you trying to progress further down the dungeon using a variety of items that you pick up along the way. Due to its roguelite nature no two runs are ever the same and this is really the hook of the game. Now Mark picked this one up really early on in the Switch's life and told me about it, he absolutely swore by it. So I ended up grabbing a physical version from America as it wasn't out over here at the time and I never regretted it. It's an absolutely fantastic game, especially at this price. The next game is Naruto Shippuden, which is the entire trilogy. It's a third person action game whereby you'll face down many of the biggest enemies from the anime, such as the nine-tailed fox. Everything about it is on a grand scale and that combat is super slick and smooth. Very enjoyable trilogy. I think you'll enjoy this one if you're a fan of the series. Next up then we have the Namco Museum Arcade Pack. Now this includes all of the games on the original Namco Museum, games such as Splatterhouse, Rolling Thunder, Dig Dug and Galaga, but also includes the Pac-Man game Pac-Man Championship Edition 2. All of this for 39% off as it currently stands. Some of these are absolute classics, especially Rolling Thunder, a personal favourite of mine. Plus the new Pac-Man game is insanely addictive, it's a great spin on a classic game. Now while many didn't like Civilization 6 as much as 5, I found that out from the comments, it was the first game that I'd played from the creators since they released the Revolution on mobile and I really enjoyed it. There's an incredible amount of content here as well as some expansion packs which have been released, you'll just have to buy those at a little extra cost. A good game, check out my review if you're interested, but it's currently 40% off which represents one of the deepest sales we've seen. Now 
Now we do try to vary the games that we mention on these lists, but some games just won't go away. They scream and scream until you stick them back on there. And Tiny Barbarian at 66% off is a fantastic deal. This is a platform game akin to some of the classics of old, things like Mega Man. It's fantastic fun, especially in multiplayer and has a really solid 8-bit pixel art look. And some of the most brutal bosses you will ever face. Brilliant in co-op. Great game. There's been a real influx of good turn-based strategy games on the Nintendo Switch and here's one that I enjoyed a lot on my review. It's called Hard West and it's currently 80% off which is around about $4. That is bonkers. By the way that means like mad or crazy for you US folk. That's a really good price for a good turn-based game set in the Wild West and it also includes all the expansion packs that were on the PC version. A very good series and a great game. Right, the next game we're going to mention is a game called Nine Parchment. Now, this is an ARPG similar to games like Diablo and the newly released Torchlight 2. The reason we are mentioning it is because it's currently 70% off. And whilst not as good as those games, I think it's fair to say, this is a very good price. So if you are looking for an ARPG, but don't want to put down the money for some of the aforementioned games, this one may well suit your needs just as well. The next title is called Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice and is a third person action RPG that follows the titular Senua. It's a very interesting game that has a binaural audio system as you follow Senua as she tries to defeat her inner demons. A good and sometimes quite scary game but it looks delightful on the Nintendo Switch. At 30% off this seems like an excellent time to pick it up. Final game then, and this one is on the EU store. It's Tales of Vesperia, the definitive edition, which comes with a whopping 40% off. Now we're gonna be honest, neither of us have played this one and we wouldn't usually recommend a game that we haven't played, but good friends of the channel, Jason, Shannon, Glover have, and they absolutely swear by it. As mentioned, this is the definitive version of the game and has HD graphics, new music tracks, and some aesthetic DLC such as costumes. This one's on sale until the 18th of September.
great stuff. Thanks so much for watching the video. We are now going to announce the winners of our Torchlight 2 giveaway that I know many of you have been waiting for. Yeah, we had a fantastic response to our competition. Some great answers. Seems that unicorns and ferrets were the most popular creatures. But the two winners are... Well, the first one is Wyatt Unger. Congratulations to you. He wrote a very funny comment using an analogy about grated cheese. <laughs> And the second was Andrew Reed, who wrote a comment about how he used to play My Little Pony with his daughter when she was a young girl, and therefore he would choose a unicorn. And having a daughter myself and Mark's the same, it just hit a bit of a chord. So well done to you two. If you message us at info at switchupgaming.com, we will get your codes to you. Thanks so much to our patrons for supporting the channel. Remember, we've still got some free games to give away if you join our patron saints. I can't say how long those games are going to last. Thank you for watching. We've had a great influx of new subscribers. It's been absolutely fantastic. Fantastic. Take care and until next time, happy gaming. For all things Switch all the time, keep it Switch up. Cheers guys, see ya!